Yo, hello everyone and welcome back again to a brand new video. In today's tutorial guys, I will be showing you how to link your AI account with Steam. So in case you had trouble linking your AI account to Steam, this is how you can do it. First, you need to sign into your Steam account. So let's open Steam, as you can see. And from there, the Steam will take a little bit of time to update, as you can know. And of course, at the same time, make sure that your EA account is opened. This is my account. And now all I need to do is wait for my Steam account to open as well. So it's going to be taking a few seconds here and there. And then it will be fully opened when it is done with the update. As you can see, now after a few seconds, it will launch right in front of us. Once more, as you can see here, after you actually launch the game on Steam, click play to launch an EA game from Steam. So this is very necessary. You have to get a game on Steam to actually, for example, let me just check here. Um, what are the games that are on Steam that are related to uh, Origin? Let's search for FIFA. Let's see if it is here. Okay. For example, let's say that you own FIFA uh, 2022 or you own, for example, FIFA 24 on Steam. Then all you need to do is to launch it. And in meanwhile, the EA app will launch and ask you to link your Steam account and your EA account automatically. So log into the EA app using your EA account info or create a new EA account. And Steam will install your game and let you know when it is ready to play. And that's how it is simply automatically it links your EA app account with Steam account. It's very clear and simple. Nothing complicated to be done by your side. It's just a few steps to be done and your accounts both your accounts are going to be connected seamlessly without having any problem and yeah this is how you can do it thank you guys all for watching if you don't have any more questions make sure to mention them in the comment section in the, in the next in this video and see you guys in the next tutorial